All right, welcome back to another video of Davian's phone collection. Today we're gonna be doing a drop test on this black Samsung Galaxy S7 on Verizon. Looks to be in very good condition, but in May or June 2024, this phone has stopped working due to the charging port and the motherboard. It's useless, so we're going to be doing a drop test on it, and unfortunately, due to the heat wave, we won't be using slow motion, and since this is another S7 that we're drop testing, we're at a different area, as you can see here. Because last year, I've drop tested the Gold S7 due to a busted screen. I have broke it by using the AV cables, and I am filming on a perfectly working S7, so expect the microphone to mute at the end. If it does, I'll do some voiceovers. Started with the backdrop, waist tight, and three, two, one. That's a hard one. Oh, the back shattered already on the backdrop. But the front looks good. Can't freaking believe the back cracked already on the waist height backdrop. That is so brittle. So brittle as you can see here. Started with the side drop, waist height, in three, two, one. Now let's take a look at the damage. Took some scuffings here. Started with the face down drop waist height in three, two, one. That's another hard one and it could shatter. And nope, no cracks. Um, we're gonna do chest height drop for this device. Cause on the gold one, there was no chest height drops. Starting with the backdrop chest height in three, two, one. And looks like the back took some more cracks. Right here. Started with the side drop, waist, I mean chest height in three, two, one. That's a perfect corner drop. And um, took some major scuffings. Some scuffings here. Overall looking good. As you can see here. Had this device for only two months and this device quickly broke. Um, about a month after it went to the collection. Starting with the face down drop, chest tight in three, two, one. That's a perfect one. Looks like the the screen just took a scuff. Oh, the AMOLED broke on it. The AMOLED just broke on this S7, but otherwise the front glass didn't crack. Just the AMOLED broke. You cannot see it on camera, but I know for sure that the AMOLED broke. This is the first time that an AMOLED on a non-working phone broke in a drop test, as you can see. Started with the backdrop head height, it's gonna crack some more in three, two, one. It does. The back is not doing well into the drop test. Starting with the side drop head height in three, two, one. That's a perfect one, as you can see. And we got some paint separations right here. And no cracks, but we do got some delamination right here onto the glass, which is rare in drop tests. Now for the moment of truth, the face down drop test. Started with the face down drop head height in three, two, one. Oh, the front glass just cracked. Unbelievable. So since it does not survive the drop test, we're gonna go ahead and smash the crap out of it. Let's do this in three, two, one. Back is getting worse. SIM ejection, SIM card slot just got out. That's a perfect smash. It's getting worse. This thing's completely destroyed. <laughs> I 
phone's getting more worse. Looks like the glass is getting peeled out. As you can see, it's completely shattered. Thank goodbye to this. As you can see, here are the parts for the S7. So let's finish this off. And do not forget that the glass is brittle. But here, as you can see here, that will do it, folks. Phone is completely destroyed and will no longer be in the collection. Yep, here's the damage. Now nah, it's gonna do me with the drop test of my second Samsung Galaxy S7 and block on Verizon Wireless. This is Davian's phone collection. Thank you for watching. I hope you like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you again in my next video.